it sounded like a tornado was going through, through here. Once they busted this window, they ran in, grabbed a chair, threw at the window, knocked over tables, and just walked out for no reason. Yeah, I understand if we had something for them to take. I understand if they were here, uh, still something of value, but they just did damage. That was it. How many times have you been through this this year? Uh, this year, probably three times already. Wow. George Floyd was the big one when that happened. They threw, I believe they broke four or five windows. We had a board everything back up. It's like everything. We're resilient. We're very resilient. My mom and dad are very resilient. We come from a war-torn country, so rebuilding and, and putting things back together and making it work is, is, is nothing new to them. But they keep coming and broken my resident a couple of times, and I can't, can't believe it. Why do you do that, you know? I'm so, so very, very sad. How are you doing? I wanted to offer you uh, some reimbursement to counteract what the looters did. This community's done more than enough for us. There's so much more people that need it than we do. 75% of our customers like that. First name basis, we know each other. They love my family yeah. here a lot. And I love them so much too. And I, when I see customer, exactly like my family. Thank you, know? you, we appreciate it. Yeah. This is our city, I mean, we love Minneapolis. This is our city. <laughs> you know, we need to come together as a community and Heal, we need a lot of healing.